Hey everyone, this is Gabe from Frame. I'm kicking off a new YouTube series that's kind of a tutorial that takes you what I'm calling from zero to hero with Frame. Really just, uh, we're gonna start it off with the very basics, just creating a frame and getting it set up. But as the series evolves, uh, we'll be doing more advanced things. And by the end of it, we will have created a really cool little corner of the metaverse just using our uh, no code creation tools and even cooler it'll be a corner of the metaverse that you can just invite people to just by sharing the link and they'll be able to meet inside of the space that you've created together you can move around as avatars and have voice chat and video chat and all sorts of other fun so uh let's dive in this first video is going to be very simple just showing you really how to get a frame so that uh, you have a link and that'll be the place that uh, you can build on and throughout the series I'll be building just on the same frame, and by the end of it, you'll be able to visit it and see what I've made, but then hopefully make your own. Okay, so the very first thing you wanna do is actually just go to learn.framevr.io on a web browser. I recommend uh, Chrome or Edge. And then once you're here, you'll see a two-step process, step one and step two. Just go through these steps. Um, step one is just signing up, uh, you can create an account, you can sign in with Google, Facebook, or Microsoft, or you can put in your email and password, and then click next, whichever one you do. I usually do the Google one. And then finally, in step two, you pick an environment. Now, you don't need to worry too much about this. You can change this later. So, you know, browse around, see which one you like, but no pressure. And then you give your frame a name. Now, this one is a little bit higher pressure because we don't let you yet change the name of a frame once you've created it. And this is the name that will actually show up in the URL, framevr.io slash whatever you put in here. Okay, so uh, that's basically all you need to do. Give your frame a name, pick a, an environment. Uh, your frame name, keep it all lowercase, no special characters. You can have hyphens though, but all lowercase. Go ahead and do that and click go there. And so long as no one else has claimed that name before, it'll say, great, that frame is yours. Uh, go right there with a link and you'll be able to click that. Now I've already done this, I've already signed up, I've already created my frame and I'm actually just gonna go there right now. I made a frame called creation-journey and that's what shows up in the link. Now once you go to your frame, it will show up with whatever environment you picked back on uh, the website. So uh, when I went through my process, I picked the small gallery and that's what shows up around me now. Now, once you land here on frame, go ahead and click the button at the top right. This pulls up the sidebar menu, and you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you're logged in with the same account that you created over on our website. So the same account that you created here, go ahead and sign in with that uh, account, and then you'll be logged in. I've already signed in, so I'm logged in. But okay, then you can close this, and here's your space. This will be the space that you can build on. This will be the space, the particular frame that I'm going to be build on, building on throughout this tutorial. You can move around, use either the arrow keys or WASD. Um, if you wanna change uh, the keyboard behavior, you can do so, just pop up the sidebar, go to your profile, and you'll see a user preferences section where you can change what the uh, keys do, rotate you or, uh, or move you around. Okay, uh, the only other thing I wanna show you is, as I mentioned, you can change the environment after you've picked one. So what I'm going to do is uh, change the environment for this frame. I opened up the sidebar, I scroll down, and I see a uh, frames section. We've got profile, inventory, frames, and how to. I'm gonna to go to frames, and I'm gonna to go to the frame settings dropdown. Now scroll down a little bit, and this is where you can adjust all sorts of cool stuff in your frame. We only need to mention one of them right now, and that is the environment picker. If you click on this picker, you'll see a number of really cool environments that you can choose from. And you can change these right on the fly. So let's say you want the resort. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, click on the resort, and you'll see that it will change the environment. Okay, so there you have it. You've created a frame and you've changed its environment. You've made an account and you've signed in. 
I think this is the environment that I'm actually going to use for the rest of the tutorial. So I'm good with this. I'm going to close the sidebar and I'm going to wrap up this video. In the next video, we're going to dive into some of the cool things you can add to your frame. I'll see you next time.